Hey guys, welcome back to another video. In, in last episode, we built this wheat farm, as you can see. And, well, I've been busy off camera, actually. I've, I've actually done the interior. So, well, I've actually redecorated inside uh, my castle. So, there used to be storage chests here. So I moved them and built this little doorway so I can fit this thing here well bubble elevator and it will go all the way up to the top and we built this room as well so I moved the um, bone mill farm thing over here so you put seeds in there or any like anything and it will compost it down into this bone mill it's just a save on storage really and yeah I'll just change this room up a little bit built this um, little uh, wall here and this room's pretty much the same as well and this will take you all the way up to the top so I don't have to walk up those um, stairs so that's pretty handy and I've got a drop down over here built this little um, pond oh I missed that oh well yeah so well, off camera, I've been doing this, and I've actually built a bone mill farm, so like a skeleton farm. I found two spawners in this cave, and yeah, I just built a farm out of it. So, I'll meet you there. Okay guys, this is my um, skeleton farm. So, all these bones in here, and arrows, so we have plenty of arrows to fight the ender dragon. And we've got um, this that brings you up to the surface. All this as well. And yeah, there's two spawners up there. And you get so much XP. So if I put that in my offhand, you get so much XP. So this is basically my XP farm for right now. And yeah. Actually, I went to the nether and I was building a wither skeleton farm, but I didn't finish it. But I found mushrooms, which we can make um, weakness potions. So we can um, have the villager trades really low. So that will be handy as well. So this will just take you up to the surface. Hopefully it's not night. It takes ages. I almost drowned in here. Actually, I did. I did actually fall to my death in there. So, yeah, it's not night time. So only the skeleton spawn is only right here. My castle's up there, and that's this is where we. Um, actually, let me take a few things out of this chest because I'm still making trips back to try and get all this stuff and put it in my storage. So yeah, that's all done. So I'll meet back at the castle and I'll show you show you something. Okay guys, we've made it back to the castle, and actually in today's episode I do want to build, I don't know which one I should build first, I mean we've got this over here, we can start building the, the next tower, but I don't know what I'm going to put in it, um, so we've got this tower over here which will be my storage room, so I'm debating whether or not to build this so I can have my storage room in here or that I mean I'm thinking this castle here because then we can have a storage room then and also I do want to show you something else I built a a sheep farm I'm just wondering how much wool it's got because it's been I don't know maybe 20 minutes since I built this so let's just check how much wool it's got. So I've got multiple sheep in in well, like one pen. This is the redstone at the back, so it's just rapidly firing. Oh, can't get up. Yeah, I just want to check how much. Um, oh, that's pretty decent amount. Yeah. Take that out there. Yeah. 
So it's got a minecart with a hopper underneath here, so it collects all the wool. So and then I've got you have to have the um, the grass around it so it can grow back. So yeah, that's pretty good. At least we've got wool coming in, so we can get some villagers and we can start trading wool for emeralds. So that'll be another source. Yeah, I just want to do the castle now. So let's hit super fast build mode and get this done. I got a feeling. So guys, we've finished the castle, but it's not done just yet. We need to add the details in, and I'll do that off camera. So, what I'll do off camera is that I'll join, um, break all these fences, join this up, probably to this wall here, and I'll do some detailing in this part, and I'll just, I think I'll fill this in probably, and I'm going to add some windows. But they won't be used because I'm going to have my storage room in this part. But I do actually want to do a mob farm in that part because I don't think I'm going to need that much storage in all of that. But yeah, I'm going to do a mob farm. So it will go down the middle of my um, storage room and it will look pretty good actually. I'm going to do it in glass maybe actually I might do it tinted glass the uh, yeah so you, there's no light going through so I'll show you the interior which I have not done yet and I'll do that off camera in a minute so this will be my future storage room and then in the middle there will be a glass tube that all the mobs will be flying down into and then they'll be killed down there for this mob farm to work properly I think I might need to light up all the caves which I have done quite a bit so I'll, I'll light up all the caves underneath the ground and this will be a mob farm I've already tested it all mobs spawn in here it's actually a pretty good number of mobs actually so yeah I have to cover that up so it's no light coming through. Just yeah, I'll show you when when I come back. But I don't know. I think I might block this room off. So 
this room will join to this room, but you won't be able to get in there. I think it might make a window here or something so you can look in. But yeah, just just the thought. And yeah, I think yeah, because this storage room is not really that good. I I might carry on this design out of the room, out of the whole room. Because I mean I've got like dirt and sand in this one and glass but it's in the same row as the mob loot and as well as the stone I've got so much stone I had to like so they're all joined together and it's really annoying me so yeah I think this would be good for uh, the storage room I've still got a bit of stone left got quite a bit actually but yeah, I think I'll save this for the other castle, which I'll probably do, um, don't know when, but, yeah, I don't know what I'm going to use the other castle for, probably just, in like, decorate it or something, and then, um, yeah, let's go all the way up to just get a better look at this, because I haven't really got a plan for how this is going to lay out. Because we've got this now. Now, I don't know what to do around here. I think I might flatten this land and just have it as like, I don't know, like a camp sort of thing over here. And then there'll be like more castles all the way around this whole island. I don't know about over there. I think I might just make custom trees over here and I just have this whole thing as my castle then I can expand I don't know which way to expand I think maybe have this as a dock docking area and then uh, I don't know maybe I think there is quite a bit of land that way so I'll just keep on expanding that way and we always have um, this land over here but I think my mate I might make this a farming land, so like a barn, everything you need for a farm. So I think I might do that. I don't know. I might do that next episode, just clear all this and then have this as a big mining area, like a quarry. And then, yeah, have a pathway, like I said, up this way. So yeah, I'll be back when I've done all the interior. Yeah, I'll be back. Hey guys, I didn't manage to do the interior, but I did do this middle part here for the mob drop. And I as well, I've done the redstone. Well, I'm trying to do the redstone actually, but I, I can't figure it out. I'm just trying to power this dropper in here. So it can power all these, all the uh, water, so it can push all the mobs down into there. But I can't figure that out yet. I'll, I'll try and do it next episode. So, yeah. I think this is a good time to end the video. If you enjoyed, please consider like, liking and subscribing to our YouTube channel. Bye. I'm never